Hey love bugs, it's Roz, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I am doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, this channel is just taking off. I'm just so blessed that you are allowing me just to give you the the information that I go through basically is telling you what I do on a day to day basis and experience with or is just come across things that I know that I can really truly resonate with that others might be able to do a study. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you are comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're just open up telling me about your empathic gift and how it's in, impacted your life in a positive direction. Or even if it is, you know, impacted you in a negative way, but you have put it, you know, manifested it towards a positive direction, which is always good. So, and if you feel like the video has been informative to you or just gave you some good vibes and you feel like a loved one or a friend needs to hear it, go ahead and do so. And if might as well, go ahead and give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. And thank you so much for stopping by my channel today. And I hope you're able to get something out of the content of my video. Y'all, I'm going to do a pause for the cause, my bad. Sorry about that, y'all. I'm still up here so tired. I'm making these videos and forgot to put on my meditation music after that. You know, I try to make sure they're just like really relaxing music that, you know, I'm playing in the background just for it to be soothing and, you know, just really relaxing when you watch it. And um, the video I'm watching today is Heavenly Calming Music for Sleep Meditation, Relaxation, Relaxing Sleep Music, Gentle Sleep for 10 Hours. I will post that link in the description box below. And the video I'm doing today um, is Hayoka's, uh, I mean, no, Empath going through a shift of a lifetime. Y'all got all my, my one, you know, all the content of my videos written down in my book. So I just try to keep it all down and just try to mark them off. But yes, Empath, we are going through a major shift. And you've probably been feeling it each and every day. Each and every day. And it might be a little bit like, Dad, Rosalind, I thought I was done. Nope. It's like that movie Stephen King came out with, Rose Red. It's like, you're not done until they say it's done. <laughs> That's what it is. Because you think you're all done. Like, oop. You like that, uh, what is that? That, that daggone, um, commercial for State Farm commercial. <laughs> oh, you gotta be talking to that. <laughs> That's what it's telling you. Because if you don't understand that shift, if you don't understand that shift, it'll bamboozle your butt every day on time. But that's okay because you know it's preparing you for something so great and so beautiful. I don't know what it is. But, you know, there are days that I could be meditating or I could be listening to music and I would just get this, like, burst of energy, like, ah! <laughs> I just be start screaming. I just start screaming and getting excited. You know, sometimes my kids will be just like, Mom, are you okay? <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I'm fine, baby. I'm fine. And I'll just get this bur burst of laughter or just happiness. And sometimes I'll get emotional and just start crying because something that's just so beautiful just came past my way. And it's just like, I don't know what it is, but it's just like universe be telling me, Rosalind, Y'all are about to be prepared for something you're not even, you're not even going to grasp. You're not even going to take the concept. It's going to be like, it's like you got slapped with something like, you know, like you watching that, um, like one of those shows where it's like, it got you at the edge, edge of your seat. And I'm not talking about a movie, I'm talking about a show. And it get right there at the cliffhanger and it drop a bomb on you like, well <laughs> you were expecting that and that's how you're gonna feel and that's what they keep telling me like right now i'm like i'm tired y'all so i'm acting goofy as i don't know what but it's like excitement exciting vibes that i get like if y'all watch me on my other one it probably i probably look delirious i said you know i asked universe i said y'all know i'm tired i've been 
you know, doing laundry today, cleaning up my house, you know, trying to keep a one-year-old baby. Now, I bet my children, my youngest is 17 years old. <laughs> that should let you know how long it's been since I deal with babies. You know, I, I've dealt with friends that got babies, but I never had to watch them like that. So that was a lot. But it's just like when you're going through stuff and you might have stuff on your mind. And I'm just like asking you first, can you just bring me something just not even just like downplay what I'm going through, but just allow me to get a break from it. And I be that you got to be careful what you ask for on stuff like that. <laughs> you got to be careful what you ask for because my grandbaby had me like stretched out all day. But I love that because I was tired from something I enjoyed doing. You know, when you get, you don't want to be tired from something that is just like, it can suck the life out of you. You know, you want to be tired because you enjoyed your time with loved ones or you did something that you enjoy doing. So it's just like when we have those hard days, we have to hurry up and snatch out of it. And I know you like Roz on this, sometimes it's hard to do. Trust me, player, I know. <laughs> I said, I know. I know. It can be hard. It can be hard to snap out of it. Like, go, it, especially if it take you to a zero to a hundred real quick. You know, it's really hard to get back, back to that, that, you know, that happy zone. But you have to be able to think that way because it's like the devil is busy right now. And I, like I told y'all, it's like you have so you pushing out so much love right now and God's on one side of the playing field trying to get us all riled up for you know, not riled up, but just prepared for whatever he needs us to go to battle for. We're going to battle right now. And it's just like we, we need to be prepared, be prepared for whatever negative thing that comes your way. You have to be able to stand firm in that, like, oh no, to not today. <laughs> not today the devil is a lie you have to be that way sometimes because it's like you know things to be thrown at you and you like i ain't even about to deal with this today you know there's sometimes you have to even just don't even deal with it don't even deal with it just keep on just keep on keeping on you just stay on that peripheral vision like you got them things like them horses have on their face and don't worry about the things that's going on with you because you're about to have some blessings coming in your life and i have to keep telling myself or reminding myself that same thing too like if i'm gonna preach this stuff to you i gotta be able to take my own advice and there's days that i'll talk to y'all it's not gonna be perfect there's days that you know i have to really fix myself before I make my videos at times. So it's like today it's all right, but I'm just tired from, you know, dealing with the, you know, with my grandbaby and stuff like that. But that's positive things to be tired of. Like when I'm, when I, that's why I try to do a lot of my videos during the day so I can be able to relax during the night. And it's like most of the time I've been so daggone stretched out, but it's okay. Because it's like I'm, when you work hard at things and you know you're doing something because you're on your grind trying to make things better for yourself trust me when that 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 downtime comes it's gonna be very well appreciated and it's just the fact that you just got so many blessings coming in and i know it might be hard to believe right now when you're going through so much stuff you can be going through so much stuff and it, it, it's just like you know you could get that synchronicity and you look it up and university you got some good news is coming your way of good vibes right now or the angels are holding your hand right now you be like you know where will you hold my hand when i need to get, make that check clear <laughs> you know when y'all hold my hand because it's something like that but you <laughs> you don't have to worry about stuff like that you know it's like you know universe will supply what you need to supply but you know i'm sorry i went into medea mode <laughs> but I'm serious. You know, there's times like, you know, we're, we're like the universe where you at when we go through certain things. But there's certain things we just got to handle on our own. We we will get the bigger picture like, oh, dang. You know, because there's some time I'm like, damn, I felt so stupid. <laughs> I could have figured this out a long time ago. But it's okay because we learn from stuff like that. If we wouldn't be, I wouldn't be learning from these videos. My, my mistakes pay off very well. <laughs> my mistakes and me being redundant and being kind of slow on stuff makes it you know it's benefit me in the long run it's been benefit me on the long run so i hope you were able to resonate with this video i hope y'all had a you know starting off on the hump day or whatever it's yeah it's starting off on the hump day and you know is rest in peace to all the people that were lost in 9 11 i didn't want to 
stray away from that, but I just try not to put my energy on that because that, I know that was like, that was the day when, when the world just seemed like it all came together and fell apart at the same time. So, you know, rest in peace and God's graces to the people that have lost their lives on 9-11. So I hope everybody stays blessed. Drop me a line. I love the chance to hear from you. Give me a thumbs up. Like it, even share it. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And even drop me a line. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even give me a thumbs up and share on your social media favorites. And send out as much love and positivity and like that you possibly can. And know that you are blessed and highly favored and truly loved. And know that there's always somebody praying out there for your better days. So I will see you on my next video. Know that you are blessed and highly favored. And I'm going to say that again because there's some people that really need to truly know that, even though you might not realize it at times. But many, many love and blessings and just beautiful vibes your way towards anybody who needs it. And I will talk to you on my next video. Peace and be wild.